If you're quite new to dodging and burning, a very simple method to get you into learning how to do it is by using curves. So here we have the background layer. I'm going to go into adjustments. I'm going to choose the curves adjustment, grab the middle and push it up to around about there, just where I'm highlighting these areas. As that's created a mask, press Ctrl and I, and it hides that. Next, I'm going to create another curves adjustment layer, and this time in the middle, I'm going to pull that down. And that should give us enough contrast between the two. And then again, press Ctrl and I, and that hides that. So this one I am going to call Burn, and this one I'm going to call Dodge. As these are hide all masks, we need to paint in white. And for this, I am leaving the opacity at 100% and my brush at 100% just to let you see what is happening. So I'll bring on my brush. So what I'm going to do is I am just going to paint over here. I'm using the mouse for this. And just paint in. You can see that that's already bringing up the highlighted areas. Now, we can see that that's too bright. So it's now at the point where I would turn it down using the opacity slider just to where I would like to see it. 17 looks okay, turn that off. And we are just using it to highlight certain areas. So if I go into the burn layer and I change the brush back to white, I'm going to increase the brush size and just paint over it. And I am being very liberal with this just to let you see for this video. That's as much as I can change that area there. But what I can also do is I can go back in to the curve and drag it down slightly. Just to around about there. Hopefully that lets you see a very simple method of using curves to dodge and burn.